What is up guys and welcome to the ninth episode of the 7 Minute Squad series in FIFA 15 Ultimate Team. So today guys, um, we're going to be having obviously another 7 Minute Squad Builder and it's going to be pretty interesting because now the current squad thing is going to be back. That's going to be quite cool. And also, um, we are going to be actually building our hybrid around two players, which is going to be nice to see as well. So, the first player that we're going to get to build a hybrid around is going to be from a pack. And then the second player is going to be from the transfer market. So, who did we get in this first pack? We managed to get Levetsi. That's a nice pack, lads. That is a nice pack. Okay, so, we've got Levetsi. Um, he can be our left winger. And we'll just store the remaining items in the club. That's not a bad pack, is it? You know, that's probably one of the better packs we've had so far in the 7 Minutes Squad series. Um, and also, guys, if you're looking to buy any FIFA 15 coins, you're never to go in the description down below and use the discount code JACK54HD for 5% off your order. So, we are going to make it uh, gold and we're going to buy the third player off the third page, okay? So, one, two, three, third player off the third page. We have got Colotto, okay. Um, we can work with that, I think. <laughs> well, it, he's another Argentinian, so that makes life a little bit easier for us. Um, yeah, fingers crossed we can build quite a nice squad, okay? We're going to have to be using kind of like a three-back formation, I guess. Um, we're going to create a new squad, start from scratch, and just call it DDDDD. I really do need to sort out my squad's names and stuff like that. So, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use the... 3-4-1-2 formation, okay? Um, that means we're going to have Levetsi here in this left wing role. But it's actually going to be a left midfield role, so I will change the position quickly. Where is it? Left wing to left mid. There we go. And then we have got our other centre back, who is going to be there. And he is called... Let me have a look for him. Let me try and find him. Where has he gone? Um, he's just, Yeah, Colotto. Okay, so... There we go, that is our link so far, and he plays for Espanyol, and obviously Levetsi plays for PSG. So, let's go into the transfer market and uh, see what we can do. So, let's move in to this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get the timer up and ready. Almost forgot to even get the timer up and ready then. Um, okay, so, the timer's going to start in 3, 2, 1. There we go, the timer has started. So... First player that we're going to go and buy, um, I don't really know, to be fair. Um, we're going to go into the league of BBVA first. We're going to start from the back and move forward. If that makes any sense whatsoever. Um, okay, league of BBVA, Espanol. Espanol, come on, where are you? This is it. Okay, goal players as well. We need to have a look at some goal players. Okay, so they have a decent goalkeeper, which was my main worry, um, I'm going to be honest with you. So... That is good. We've got a we've got a decent goalkeeper. Store him in the club. What other players do we have? We've got a CDM here, Canas. Um, there's not many other goal players so that we could fit into the team. So we're gonna make it silver quickly. Um, is there any? No, there is not. Okay. All right. Well, we can work with this. We can work with this. Um, I'm feeling. I'm feeling like. Putting potentially um, Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I know exactly what I want to go ahead and do. So we are gonna make we're gonna go ahead and buy a another centre back but a Spanish guy, okay? A Spanish Yeah, a Spanish centre back, so we can literally go ahead and buy anyone from PK um, I feel like using PK. Why not? Let's just try PK. I've probably played a lot over the odds for him there. Um, so, yeah, I do apologise. So, now we can move on and move to... I might actually change it to Ramos. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Um, anyway, CDM. or Actually, no, it's going to be centre mid, isn't it? We're going to go to the Barclays Premier League quickly. Barclays Premier League, Arsenal. I just need to think about this. Hmm... Do need to think about this. I didn't really... Okay, no, that's not going to work, is it? That's not going to... Actually, hold on. Chemistry. Yes, it is going to work. Is it? Yes, it is going to work because we're using the 3-4-1-2 formation. That's the only reason it's going to work. Okay, so, centre mid. Barclays Premier League. Now we can get rolling. Um, Barclays Premier League. Arsenal. Spain. 
Let's do this. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and buy Mikel Arteta. Now, Arteta is actually a pretty decent player. Um, he seems to be lacking in pace this year. 43 pace, that's quite a big downgrade from what he was. I believe it was like 70s or 60s last time. Um, so that's a bit of, that's a bit strange. But we're also going to buy another centre mid, and it's not going to be a DRB. Um, we want to go ahead and buy Flamini, and I don't know why Flamini isn't coming up. Maybe he's been a CDM as default, but um, I'm sure I've seen him in a centre mid position as well. Anyway, we've got Flamini, Flamini um, that's the main, main thing, and then we're going to go to uh, Uruguay. Let's go to Uruguay, Barclays Premier League, and search Golden Centre attack in mid, and we are going to go ahead and buy... Ramirez, okay. He looks like a pretty overpowered player, to be fair, doesn't he? He does look fairly overpowered, so we will assign him now. And there we go. He is in the club. The next player we're going to have to go ahead and buy is from the Liga, so PSG as well. Let's go now. And we're going to go ahead and buy Edison Cavani. It's very strange to see him still like 10,000 coins. Like, why is he so cheap? I would have expected him to be much more expensive at this moment in time, maybe like 30k, but I suppose Ligue 1, I suppose it's a league that a lot of people use, but Uruguay in the Ligue 1, it's kind of hard to fit him in a, in a decent team. Um, or he might just not be very good, I don't know, I haven't used him yet, but by his stats, I think he looks like a kind of player which I will do pretty well with. Um, so now we're going to move on back to the box Premier League. Um, I'm trying to think, what can I do now? Let me have a little look at the squads, okay? So, we've got PK there, he gets a link there. And then we've got the goalkeeper there. Right, so, hmm. I don't wanna make this too Frenchy. I don't wanna make this too Frenchy, but this could be quite cool, to be honest. What French right mids are there? Okay, there's Ben Arthur, Biarbiani, hmm. I'm not sure. I kind of do want to include a five-star skiller, like really badly. So I might just use Ben Arthur. I'm going to use Ben Arthur. Okay. Um, is that the best option? I'm trying to think. No, actually, scrap that. Yeah, scrap that. Yeah, yeah, we're going to scrap that. Um, <laughs> okay, we're going to do the centre backs first before I move into that. Okay, so we need to go ahead and buy two centre backs. One from the Liga BBVA, quickly. Well, two from the Liga BBVA, actually. We're gonna go ahead and buy Ramos and also, uh, okay, so Ramos is there. Fuck me, he's, he's expensive, isn't he, now? Bid, and then we're gonna go ahead and buy Varane as well, but I have him in my club, so that's absolutely fine. So we've got them two sorted. Um, now, we are gonna go ahead and, right, hold on a second. Yeah, now, we're gonna go ahead and move to the right midfield spot from the Barclays Premier League and have a little look. We can literally do whatever we want. So I'm gonna buy, I, I was looking at Sanchez and thinking I really wanna use him, but now that I've got, I've already got two Arsenal players in here. So I'm a bit reluctant to go ahead and, and use him to be honest. We've got all the, well we have got, kind of got, we've got all the time in the world, but we kind of don't as well. Do you know what? I'm kind of tempted to use Sterling or Markovic or something like that. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're gonna get we're gonna get Markovic, okay? We'll assign him now, and then we're gonna go ahead and get Balotelli as well, because I'm up for using Balotelli. I haven't really used him yet on this game, and I feel like he could be a pretty good striker. Um, and I get to use two two uh, Premier well, two Liverpool players as well, so that makes me happy. Um, so yeah guys, that is gonna be the end of this squad building part. As you can see, we've got about, well you can't really see, but we've got about 15 seconds left now. Um, and yeah, we've pretty much got our team sorted. So thanks for watching guys. I'll be back with you in a second once we have got everyone on the starting 11 and the timer is about to go off. There we go. <laughs> okay guys, so this is our finished team. So in goal, we have got Casilla. The two, well, the three centre backs, sorry. We have got Colotto, Ramos, and also Varane. Right midfield, we've got Markovic. Two centre mids, we've got Flamini and also Arteta. Left midfield, we've got Levetsi. Centre attacking mid, we have got Ramirez. Two strikers, we've got Cavani and also the big man Balotelli. So, 
I'm excited to use this team, you know. I think there's a wide range of different players, and um, I think we're going to do very well. You know, our attack looks absolutely class, to be honest. Um, Balotelli, Cavani, then on the wings we have got Lovetsi and also Markovic, all with decent pace as well, especially our wingers. So this is going to be very interesting. Hopefully our team can perform, and I'm excited to use Ramirez, actually, in that center taking mid position. So this is our opponent, as you can see here. He has got a really, really strong um, mainly French side, but he also has uh, Betty Mo at the left back spot and also Lovetsi on the left wing. Um, it's kind of like a French team from loads of different leagues, so it's just like a, yeah. Um, anyway, he has Gorkov, Lacazette, you know, he's got a lot of really good players, but I'm sure we can, we can do some damage um, with our strike forces, you know, as, as good as it is. No, oh, I've done him, he's... Is that really a penalty? Really? Kabai looks a little bit uneasy. Turns out he wasn't uneasy. Oh, for oh, that's just stupid. Oh well. Don't you really Gorkov? Really, really, really? That's that is just absolute shit. That is three nil down already. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. That's gonna be another goal. I don't believe this. Go. Here we go. Finish that. Fucking finish that. There we go. Balotelli. We've got one back at least. Go. 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 That's a pen. Surely. Thank you very much. Let's just get this over and done with. Go on. Please go in. Get in. He went the right way. <laughs> he did go the right way. Um, God, man. If that had got in. Oh. Go. 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 That's another penalty, surely. Send him off, mate. Come on, please score, please score. Get in, there we go, right. We've got three minutes, I don't know what's gonna happen, lads, but um, we've shown we've shown that we, we can actually score with this team and that I genuinely feel like his, when, oh, I'm just gonna. That you, um, you had, you, you, you. There we go, lads, anyway, that was uh, the the most bullshit match I've probably played this this FIFA today. Um, I don't understand. I really don't understand. That was just absolutely awful. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed this video, guys, please be sure to leave a like. That'd be absolutely amazing. Um, there's going to be an Ultimate Team uh, career mode up tomorrow, so make sure you don't miss that. I apologise. That was that was oh, dreadful. So frustrating. So frustrating. But yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, drop a like on it if you did, subscribe for more videos like this daily, and peace.